Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. Today we're gonna to be talking about how to check your Nikon camera's shutter actuations to see what kind of usage your camera has had, especially if you just bought a used Nikon camera. And this is really important because then you kind of get an idea how much life is left on your camera and how much longer you really have to use this because shutters do wear out, unfortunately. So let's go ahead and get into this. I'm gonna show you exactly what to do step by step. So the first thing that we wanna do for step one is just take a picture of anything, okay? That's gonna be the first thing to do. There you go. And that is to get the latest shutter actuation. Actuation, I can't say it very well because it's, I don't know why. Anyway, to get the latest shutter actuation for your camera. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna pop out that lovely memory card. First, turn off your camera, pop out that memory card and then pop it into your card reader and I'll tell you what to do next. All right guys, so the first thing that we're gonna do is after you put your memory card into your computer, into your memory card reader, you're gonna go to a website called camerashuttercount.com. I found this one on Adorama. I tried a couple other ones and unfortunately they had a malware um, virus thing come up on my computer. Luckily I have malware um, protection, but this one I found on Adorama. So I feel that it's a lot safer to use. So go ahead and check that out. I'll put the link in the description for this website. And as you can see down below here, you have a list of cameras that this is compatible with and will read the metadata for. So you can go ahead and check your shutter count on your camera and see basically how much life is left on your camera. So go ahead and say choose file. And this is my memory card. So I'm gonna go all the way to the bottom and pick my last image. I'm gonna open and hit upload. All right, so it takes a little bit to get in there so it can read the metadata. All right, there we go. There are my results. My shutter count is 34,250 and it says I have 23% left. Um, no, it says 23% of this model's expected life shutter life. So that means I actually have a good chunk of this camera uh, for its life left. So I'm really happy and really pleased about that. And, uh, I highly suggest that, uh, you do this because it gives you some peace of mind. All right, guys. So I hope that helped you out a bit, you know, just to give you an idea of, um, how to check your shutter count for your Nikon camera. Um, as you can see, it works with other cameras as well. So if you know anybody, go ahead and recommend that website to them so they can check the shutter on their camera. I feel that this is really important when you're buying your camera off the used market, um, for any used camera really, then especially if they don't tell you um, what the shutter count is online or wherever you're buying this camera from because some people can kind of be shady sometimes and not tell you and maybe even lie to you and be like, well, this camera actually has a lot more than what you said. But it's, I just feel it gives you a peace of mind and helps you understand how much life is left on your camera. At least give you an idea of what you're working with. All right, so if this helped you, please hit that like button. Please, if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. And I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you're all doing well. All right, well, that's it for today. Please take care and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, bye. If you like this video, please hit that like button and subscribe to my channel to get notified when new videos get posted. Thank you for watching this video. Please consider checking out some of the other videos on the links at the end of this video.